السلام علیکم آئی ڈیئر فرینڈس ویلکم بیک ٹو انٹرنیشنل اپرچونٹی ہب فرینڈس مائی نیم از عاقب شہزاد اینڈ ٹوڈے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو ڈسکس اے ویری انٹرسٹنگ اسکالرشپ اپرچونٹی دیٹ از آفر بائی دا یونائیٹیڈ اسٹیٹس ایجوکیشنل فاؤنڈیشن پاکستان دیٹ از فل بلڈ اسکالرشپ فار ماسٹر اینڈ ڈاکٹر ڈگری اسٹوڈنٹس سو اے پلیٹفارم دیٹ ہیلپس پاکستانی اسٹوڈنٹس فل فل دیئر ڈریمس آف اسٹڈنگ ان دا یونائیٹیڈ اسٹیٹس سو دو یونیک ایجوکیشنل اینڈ کلچرل ایکسچینج پروگرام یو ایس ای ایف پی پرووائڈس اپرچونٹی ٹو پاکستانی ٹو اسٹڈی ریسرچ اینڈ انگیج ود انٹرنیشنل اسٹوڈنٹس اسکالرس اینڈ پروفیشنل ان دا یو ایس سو فرینڈس آئی ایم گون اپلائی فار دس پروگرام سمبلی کے لیے کین اپلائی ناؤ دا پروموٹنگ میوچول انڈرسٹینڈنگ تھرو ایکسچینج پروگرام اپلیکیشن آر ناؤ اوپن فار فل بیڈ ڈگری پروگرام ٹل ٹوئنٹی ایٹ فیبرری So the eligibility, Pakistani citizens with a strong academic history residing in Pakistan and committed to returning to and serving Pakistan, we welcome to apply. All discipline or eligible except clinical medicine, eligible master applicant will have a fourth year bachelor degree or a bachelor and master combination of six years of education. The graduate required examination is required for all applicants. Shortlisted candidates will be required to take the Duolingo English test. So click on start application, then continue it. So you can check here frequently asked question and eligibility criteria, standardized examination program policies. How many scholarships will be awarded? In 2025, the US EFP hopes to award 150 Fulbright scholarships. Can I apply for a master leading to PhD? No. You cannot apply for a master leading to PhD. You can apply for one degree only, either a master or PhD degree program. Can I apply for MBA program? Yes, you can apply. I have MBBS degree. Can I apply? Yes, but not in clinical medicine or for specialization. You can apply for research focus field such as public health. So you can check other frequently asked question. Is the TOEFL also required for the application? No. TOEFL is not mandatory with the application that during the test of English will be required from all the shortlisted candidates. So in this application process, you don't have to need any during the test or IELTS or TOEFL score. You can apply without this test. So does it cost anything to apply? No. There is no application fee to apply for this program. Then start application. So this is the login portal. So if you are a new user, then first of all, you have to start a new application. You have to put your email and your CNC then submit it. So as I already created my account, I am going to log in my account. For this, I have to put my email address and password then continue with the existing application. So my dear friends, in this way you can log in your account. So friends, this is my officially application form for this full blood scholarship 2020, 2024 to 2025 academic session. So you have to complete this all section very carefully. The application instruction you can check it here. Then click on start application. Firstly you have to complete your general information section then your study plans, your education, your occupational experience, your examination result, your emergency conduct, your study and research objective, your personal statement, your documents, your personal information, your reference and your personal financial information your university preference and then after that you can review your application and then submit your application form I am not going to apply for this program but hope so you understand that how you can access this on application platform so friends my application is now 70% completed so you have to complete your application form 100% after that you can review and then submit your application form. There is no application fee to apply for this full blood scholarship program. So avail this opportunity and also share this video with your other colleagues. Thank you so much guys for your support. Take care. All of us.